Good morning, everybody. How are you, Fresh Wind? How many of you were outside in the rain waiting to get in? I feel sorry for you. Are your blankets wet? I hope not. My name is Chris. I'm the Young Adults Pastor here at Catch the Fire Toronto. Are you guys excited about today? I am excited about today. I've loved Fresh Wind. I haven't been to a Fresh Wind. I was here the last two, then I missed nine years. So I'm so excited to be back at Fresh Wind. Do you guys want to stand up, come to the front, find some space? Tonight we're going to press, or today we're going to press in all day to what Holy Spirit wants to do. So how about just as we start this morning, how about everyone just like stick out your hands, either stick, stick them up to heaven or stick them out like you want to receive a gift from God. And just everyone say this, Holy Spirit, fill me right now. All I want is you. I give you my full attention, spirit, soul, and body, in the name of Jesus. Amen. I'm excited for today and just to today press into what, whatever God has for you. Jonathan Clark is me leading us in worship today and it's going to be amazing. Are you guys ready? All right, let's do this.
and every eye closed across this place. Let's just put our attention on him this morning. Let's sing to his heart. Worthy is the Lamb who was slain. Worthy is the King who conquered the grave. Worthy is the Lamb who was slain. Worthy is the King who conquered the grave. Yeah, worthy is the Lamb who was slain. Worthy is the King who conquered the grave. Worthy is the Lamb who was slain. Worthy is the King who conquered the grave. Yeah, Jesus, would you say you're worthy? You're so worthy. I want to give you all our worship this morning. I want to fix all our attention on you.
Would you join me this morning? We're gonna welcome the Spirit of God just to come and fill this place. You guys up for that? Come on. So why don't we just lift our hands out. It doesn't, doesn't do anything special. It's just us saying, God, I'm here, I'm open. I'm here, I'm open, I just want you. And we're all gonna be the prayer team this morning. Is that okay? So I want you just to start praying Use your own prayers. If you speak in tongues, that's great. I want you just to start welcoming Holy Spirit just to come and fill us. We're gonna ask for joy to come and fill us. So just lift up your own prayers right now. Lift up your own prayers. Just start speaking out, invite Him. Invite Him, lift up your voice. Lift up your voice, welcome Him. Welcome Him in this place. We invite you, Holy Spirit, come and fill us with joy. Come fill us with joy.
Yeah. 
You'll pour out the oil of gladness over us. Yeah, pour out the oil of gladness over us. Come pour out the oil of gladness over us. And we invite you again. Holy Spirit, come move. Holy Spirit, come move on our hearts. 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 Pour it out, pour it out. Pour it out, pour it out. Every voice sing, pour it out, pour it out. Pour it out, pour it out. Every voice sing, pour it out, pour it out. Pour it out, pour it out. Every voice sing, pour it out, pour it out. Pour it out
it out, pour 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 it out, Jesus, pour it out, 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 pour it out.
faithfulness my heart will sing this I will give you all my Jesus, we just want to give you a bit more love this morning. Jesus, you, 
you are our first love, it is you. Our hearts desire lovely things will soon pass away, but you'll remain. Let's sing that with me, Jesus, you. Jesus, you, you are our first love, it is you. Our hearts desire lovely things will soon pass away, but you'll remain. Yeah. 
Don't be the first love This you'll be the only one you'll be You'll be the first love You'll be the only one Oh Jesus You'll be the first love You'll be the only one just tell him we love him just lift up your voice just tell him you love him this morning we love you we love you we love you come on raise a voice raise a voice this morning Jesus we love you we love you you're a heart's desire we love you we love you we love you we love you Jesus As we were worshiping, I just, I felt like Holy Spirit wants to come and just remove any fear or any anxiety or any shame that you've been carrying. And the image I got was like he was cracking an egg over all of our heads. 
And that's like the yoke just like covered us. It just engulfed everything that was bad and just like washed away it. And it was just, what was left was just this love, this tangible presence that you could feel that was on you. And shame and fear and anxiety and worry, it couldn't hold you anymore. It couldn't, it couldn't bother you anymore. It couldn't come against you anymore. It couldn't rob you of your thoughts, rob you of your sleep. I felt like this morning there's people that have been having nightmares and just bad dreams and cannot sleep. That you've had insomnia and you just cannot sleep at night. You cannot find peace. You cannot find a rest. And the good news today is that Jesus is the Prince of Peace and he has perfect rest for you. And so what I just wanna do is, I wanna just take one more minute and just all of us, if you've, if any ounce of you has felt these past couple weeks, these past couple months, these past couple years, that you've had anxiety, you've had worry, you've had fear, I just want you to hold out your hands and I just feel like Holy Spirit's gonna come and just crack that egg over your head. Father, right now, I just speak to every person who's felt any anxiety, any worry, any fear, any shame, that right now your presence would just crack your, your rest and your peace and your wholeness over them right now, Father. And God, we just, we believe the scripture that says that perfect love casts out all fear. And so we just speak to fear in this room. We speak to fear internally in our spirits, our soul, our bodies, and we say, leave now in the name of Jesus. You have no right. We are sons, we are daughters of yours. And so peace, just come and rest on us. Stick to us, not just on our body, but spirit, soul, body, holistically right now, we are being covered in his presence. Anxiety has no more place in your life. Insomnia has no more place in your life. Fear has no more place in your life. And it just falls right now onto the foot of the cross where everything was paid for. It falls to the cross. And right now we just speak the Holy Spirit to come and fill and replace every area where there's fear, where there's worry, where there's stress, anxiety, where there's nightmares, where there's insomnia, where there's people who've not found peace in a long time. Father, we just speak it right now into your soul and we just call it to awaken right now. Holy Spirit, fill us again. Fill us again, Holy Spirit. And I just feel like for some of you as well, that as the kind of like the spiritual stuff just washes off, there's a physical manifestation, there's a healing that will take place for your body as well. There's, there, I feel like even for things like, uh, oh, what's the word of it? For people who've had like chronic pain, if they've had arthritis, pain in their bones and their joints, if you felt like you'd be not being able to be your full self, I just feel like your body is gonna come into alignment with what's just happened in your spirit and in your soul. And so we just pray that healing over all of us right now, that as we align ourselves to you, Father, that you would come and that you would wash us clean in every way. We thank you for your presence. You're a good God. And we love you. Can we just say that to God? Can we just tell God that we love him? God, I love you so much. And taking a deep breath as well. Just breathe in that love. Breathe in everything that he's done for you. Breathe in that freedom that you have as a son and as a daughter. Yeah. Thank you, Holy Spirit. In Jesus' name. 
Amen. Oh, doesn't that feel good, guys? Do you feel that peace?